This is Mamata Samera's welcome to another solution tutorial of SOLIDWORKS. Today we are going to solve this 3D problem. In this 3D problem, this is the isometric view, this is the top view, this is the front view and this is the right side view. First I will start drawing from the top view. In the top view, first I will draw this circle. And this circle has a radius of 58. And from that circle, uh, center line center line i will draw a center line and after that center line i will offset the center line to 58 divided by 2 in the right side and in the left side also a 56 divided by 2 okay then i will cut this extra portion and i will cut this extra portion then i will again select center line and draw a center line of 88 unit and from that center line i will offset the center line to 20 28 unit in the lower side and 28 unit in the upper side and from the middle point of that center line here i will draw a semicircular profile of 28 radius then i will draw this 22 diameter circle at the middle after drawing all of this i will then extrude it to 24 unit so let's start first of all select the top plane and select sketch now select circle and draw a circle of 58 radius 58 radius now select center line and draw a vertical center line now press ok from the vertical center line i'll offset into this select this vertical center line and dimension it to 56 divided by 2 now press ok now trim all the unnecessary part that we don't need ok then select line and join this two point in the upper side and also select line and joint this two point in the lower side now press ok after that you can go to trim option and trim this vertical tool line because we don't need this tool line now i'll draw this line center line and from this center line i'll offset 28 in it in the both side so i am selecting again the center line and drawing a center line of 88 unit from that i will go to offset into this and from the offset this, select this center line and offset it it into 28 unit now press ok after that i will trim all the unnecessary part i don't need so i am trimming uh, all the unnecessary part i don't need ok now select circle and draw a circle of 28 radius and now i'll trim the unnecessary part for getting this 28 radius semicircle after that i'll draw this inner circle of 22 diameter so again select circle and draw this inner circle of 22 diameter now it's made to kit now go uh, now go to features now it's to boss now it should boss it to 24 unit so dimension it to 24 unit then uh, we can see we have a circle uh, circle of 72 diameter and this circle is it should boss it to uh, from this profile uh, 62 minus 24 unit so I'm, i am selecting this face now sketch now normal to it now select the circle and place the circle to the origin now dimension it to 72 diameter now isometric it now go to features then extrude boss and extrude boss it to 62 minus 24 unit now press ok now in the right side we have uh, we can see that uh, we have two symmetrical shape and both shape are 40 degree angle from the this horizontal line and 
this is s2 boss boss it uh, this has a s2 boss of 56 unit of total so i will start drawing from this uh, from the right plane and in the right plane i will uh, after drawing this shape i will start boss it to 56 unit in the left side and 56 unit uh, in the right side so uh, now i will start drawing from the right plane so i am selecting the right plane then sketch now normal to it now select a line and draw a incline line okay now select is my dimension and now on dimension it to uh, 45 a uh, 40 degree now again select another line and draw an draw an incline line now select is my dimension and draw and draw a angle of 40 degree now press ok i am selecting this line and now convert entity selecting convert into this now go to trim option and trim this extra line okay now press ok now uh, again select the line and select this point and select this point this will give a close shape so it means we have gotten our close shape uh, so go to features and then it stood boss and now it stood boss it to 56 divided by 2 in it in direction 1 and in the direction 2 uh, 56 divided by 2 now press ok after that we can see that we have drawn this inclined shape now we will draw this circle and this circle has a diameter of 28 and then I will have to cut it to through all now select this face now sketch now normal to it now place here and draw a diameter of 28 unit now isometric it now go to features now is to cut and now is to cut it to through all both side now press ok here we can see we have drawn our 3d sketch thank you for watching till the end thanks for watching and keep learning be different